This will be a F1DV log episode 11. Uh, I realize uh, in the midst of doing uh, 9 and 10 that I actually goofed and then I never talked about this particular thing and it is very important and that is glue. Um, what you use for glue for gluing these things up. Um, what I have here is a very old bit of Ambroid uh, that I'm going to uh, put into a container here and this one uh, God this is really dark compared to the stuff I have the newer stuff I have this is a uh, one that was made when Ambroid was in Massachusetts so it's been quite a while uh, since this particular one was made I'm just going to throw some in here I put some in there and I really should not have, but let me just clean that out second. Open up that. Okay, I'm back. So then uh, just basically put, I, I just put basically a little bit into a container. And this was a container I got from A to Z. Um, I'm not sure where to get these now, but what I like about these particular containers is that uh, when I put the syringe in the top of it, it'll sit on top of it fairly tightly, so it doesn't tend to get uh, doesn't tend to lose the acetone very quickly. Uh, this is a basic three uh, milliliter lure lock uh, syringe, and all that means is that you can plug this thing in and turn it, and it will lock in place. And it's short uh, needle. It doesn't have uh, any sort of thing on the end of it. So it's just basically flat. And what I'm going to have to do here is try to put just a little bit in here. Take this out. Try to get a little bit out of there. And then I'm going to push it forward so I can get a sense of how much glue I actually put in there. So a little bit of stuff has already come in there, a little bit of acetone, but let's figure this was about one cc I put in there, or one milliliter. So what I'm gonna do now is put it so it's about two. So I'm basically I'm just pulling this back and sucking the glue, or sucking the acetone right out of the bottle. And I'm going to try to achieve about a one-to-one -one mix here. So when I get it up to uh, two, it's got a hold there for a little bit. And when I think it's about right, I will take it out. And then I can pull it back uh, probably up to about three. And then it's a matter of sort of shaking it. You can put your finger on the end of it, a little bit less will come out. You hear my voice go as I'm doing this. Um, but this is basically, you can see how it's a little bit thick, but not nearly as thick as it was. This is a, about right, I think. Um, I'm just going to let it sit in there for a little bit and just sort of mix a little bit more internally just so it can sit. But this is basically it. I'll uh, do the shaking motion a bit later because I can see there's a bit left in there that hasn't really... I think the end of the uh, bottle, uh, when I or the, the end of the uh, Ambroid had actually been fairly hard uh, when it first came out. And so I am just have to wait a while for that to actually dissolve uh, in the acetone. Um, but that should be about it. Um, if I'm running into it being a little bit thin uh, in a bit, uh, I'll just pull the, uh, the end out and add a little bit more glue and then keep shaking it up. That should be all that's required. Thanks.